Hi, Bandana Grandma here, and this morning I am definitely no glam gram because I've just thrown my hair into braids, scrubbed my face, threw on my clothes and bandana, brushed my teeth, and out I come to work in the front garden. It's overcast today and a little bit drizzly, but the garden is a mess, and I need to pull out a lot of these very tall flower plants that are growing here. I'm going to show you what they are. Now, these orange flowers you're seeing here are called torch tithonia. And the flowers themselves are pretty. And the bees love them. I planted them two years ago and decided that it took up too much room out here. And when they start aging, they start losing leaves down here getting all brown and ugly and they just fill in too too much and look like a jungle so I was gonna plant them anymore and I didn't all these you see came up from the seed that I planted years ago they just reseeded themselves um, these flower buds die off and they make these uh, let me find one that's further along. These thorny looking seed heads. Okay, see like this? That's pretty, that's pretty stiff and prickly. Anyway, it makes these seed heads, and if I leave them, they fall and go to the ground, and next year I'll have twice it. But look at them all. I didn't plant one of these last year. And now they're filling in and taking over my garden. I have some mums there that can't get any light. So anyway, I need to pull out all these. The bees that do come on these are very docile. But if I start yanking them up, I don't know how they're going to react because they love these flowers and it's their food source. So that's what I'm doing today. And totally interrupted the landscape plan I had <laughs> so and you see how ugly they look when they start dying out on the bottom here all that brown that forms so today's the day they have to come out So here I'm just pulling up all the plants, all the torch tithonias, shaking off the roots to leave the dirt in the garden bed, and I'm going to be piling these up and dragging them out to the backyard. Now that I've got the chithonias out, I see a lot of weeds in here. I'm going to have to pull and get the garden looking good again. It's just kind of a mess. And I'll drag this pile of all the torch chithonias out to the backyard where I have my cutting garden. And I'll leave them there to reseed.
Okay, now I need to get busy and start fine-tuning these front gardens here. They're looking pretty sad.